Oh, oh, you thought I was dead. I'm not dead. Not all of me. Hi, everyone, and welcome back to D.I. Rye, the show where I, Ryan LaSala, um, author, fantasist, and uh, Pisces, sun and moon, do arts and crafts. I do arts and crafts. All right, so for anyone who is new here, I'm Ryan LaSala. Uh, I am an author. I'm a young adult author, as in I write books for young adults, although I, I, I could be a young adult. I'm not. No, I'm not. No, no. It's crazy. So today's craft is we are going to be making a, a hat. A hat that looks like a lily pad, which you're probably thinking, like, why the fuck would we do that? And that's a great question. The backstory to this is that uh, I have a I have a big event coming up on Tuesday called Big Library Read, which is this like global book club. Um, that and so it's all these people that are reading Reverie, and like a ton of people are expected to come. So I wanted to do something like very fun and interactive for the event itself. And so I thought it'd be funny if like I made like a costume or like uh, something special, you know. And like the the punchline in my head was that like what if I like in my preparation for Big Library Read like misheard it or like misspelled it or something like that and instead thought I was attending something called the Vogue Library Read and so that's why I'm going to be dressing up as like a swamp creature. <laughs> but like a fashionable swamp creature. And I might be like doing some like drag makeup, I don't really know. My point my point is I, I need a hat that looks like a, a lily pad. I've never done this project before. I did buy a bunch of supplies for this specifically because I couldn't do it with just like the garbage around my house, which is something that I usually do. And we're just we're just gonna see how it goes. So all right, so the thi so the things that I'm using for this crafting project, some green pom poms, fun felted flowers, more felt. This is gonna I I bought this absolutely horrible um, adult use only, <laughs> according to the back label headband, which uh, I'm gonna be using. It's gonna be like the base of the the hat. Some moss that looks kind of real, so like I don't know, like bog to table, I guess. And then I've gotten like a bunch of like ribbons and stuff, uh, and you'll you'll see what those are going to be used for. And last but not least, uh, I'm going to be making the base out of cardboard that I uh, salvaged from a box. Okay, so I've never done this before, but I have like a rough idea of how I want to do it. And so we're just going to give it a go and see what happens. What? I need to I need to Google a lily pad. I am now realizing I don't know what they look like. Oh, that's not true. Oh my god, that's this. I'm. I am off. Ooh, okay. Okay. We're gonna make some adjustments. Okay, so this is this is the shape. Mm. Uh, um we're just gonna keep going. Um and I think so my plan is that it's gonna sort of like sit on my head like this. Like I kinda wanna like you know. I'm gonna make this a little bit deeper and then I'm gonna cover it with felt. Can you see, can you see my eye twitching? I have so much caffeine today. It's twitching. Can you see it twitch? Whatever. Perfect. The next thing I need to do is I'm going to, um, I want to put it in this like green felt. And you know, actually before that, I decided to switch to wine. Now you may be thinking, weren't you just drinking coffee? Um, what's going on with you? Uh, and the an the answer is a few hours have actually passed. I had to go do some something else. I went to a Zoom wedding. All right, so I traced. You can't really tell. I traced it. Um, okay, so I've got my felt, and the next thing I got to do is I got to apply it to this. So I've gone ahead and wrapped it in felt. I wanted to give it some bend, so it's a little bit bendy, it's a little bit floppy, but that's okay because realism. The flower is what we're gonna do next. Okay, so. My plan is, I've got this this wired ribbon. I'm gonna do some green and then I have pink as well, but I think what I'm gonna do is I'll take a, a length of it and I'll just start to like loop it around into these like kind of messy figure, into, stop. Into these messy figure eights and then cinch it. Boom, okay. So this is one, uh, oh, and I've already broken it. Here's the other. And if you can imagine, so like here's one bow and then the other sort of layers on top of it to kind of create like that tufted look. Uh, so I made some green, I made some pink. And imagine this like... Oh no. Is this gonna be bad? <gasps> Am I gonna do a bad job? No, no, absolutely not. Nope. Okay. All right, that's much better. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <gasps> Genius. Um, and then what if, 
I did the same with the green. Okay, so, oh, I'm so nervous. I guess there's nothing to do but to start. Okay, step one. Ooh, ah, oh, fudge sickles. Oh, man, man, hot glue is hot. I know I say that every time. Now we're gonna take our like swamp green and we're gonna glue these down next. I'm using this marker to like hold it so I don't burn myself again because I am what? Learning lessons. Okay, so while we leave our glue to dry, we can, you know, contemplate things because we've got no choice but to just have a moment of silence and stillness and, you know, that's when the thoughts creep in. I prefer not thinking or having thoughts, so I'm just gonna narrate this for a little longer and but my glue's dry and I've avoided all sorts of reflections. Okay. Uh, this guy. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Look, this looks good. Wow, this looks derby fucking tastic. Mm. Oh my god, you know what would be cool? Hold on, I have. Okay, so what if I took like a pipe cleaner? I like wrapped it around something. You know those things that like come out of flowers? Like, what if I. Oh, great idea, me. Hold on. I'm gonna do this. Uh. Once again, I have gilded the lily. Oh my god, quite literally gilding the lily. That's a fucking genius costume. I should just spray paint it gold. Fuck. I mean, darn it. If I, if I was smart, I would have thought of that ages ago. How fun. And then, when you fluff out the petals a little bit, look! Look at that! Oh, this is cute! <gasps> Bitch! Yes! Oh my god, I am unrecognizable from a bog. <laughs> I could walk into any swamp I want, and I could just look like I own the place. I'm literally just like taking random bits of shit and hot gluing it together. So it's mess. It looks really messy right now. So like, don't judge me. But like, this is the the underside so far. Perfect. Oh yeah. She's a bog. She's a whole bog. So it's a little. So it's a little bit heavier than I thought it would be. So I have to stay very still. But good for photographs. Good for senior portraits. Okay, so I am ready to show you the um, semi-final product. First things first. Okay, so here's the rough collar that I made. So, uh, second, I, I, I made these little like earrings with like clip-on. Um, I like glued like clip-ons to the back of them. So I'll put these on. All right, and now last but not least, we've got the hat. Ah, oh, and this, this is the look. Ah, oh, fuck yeah. Oh, heck yeah, oh my goodness. Oh my. I really like how this came out. I will be completely honest, it's the least balanced look ever. Like, things are falling off of me, the hat is sliding around, it has to be like very particularly secured in order to, to, to be on my head, but you know what? For having never made a hat before, or a lily pad, or a rough collar, or clip-on earrings, um, I'm pretty happy with how this came out. So, if you like it, let me know. And uh, thanks for joining me for DIY, okay? Mwah! 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 Tip that for Biden. I'm the, ca I'm the captain of this ship. <laughs>